Today I'm going to show you how to work out the highest common factor by drawing up some factor trees. So we're going to work out the highest common factor of 90 and 150. So first of all then let's do our factor tree for 90. So we can split this up into 9 times 10. None of these are prime numbers so we can split these up again. So 9 we can write as 3 times 3. So both of these are prime numbers so let's circle them. Uh, 10 can be split up into 2 times 5. 2 is a prime number, 5 is a prime number. So our product of prime factors for 90 is 2 times 3 times 3 times 5. So let's repeat this then for 150. So I can write this as 15 times 10. None of these are prime numbers so we can split these up. So 15 is the same as 3 times 5. 3 is prime, 5 is prime so let's circle those. 10 we can split up into 2 times 5. 2 is prime, 5 is prime. So our product of prime factors for 150 is 2 times 3 times 5 times 5. So to work out the highest common factor then from the products of prime factors which we just found, we just need to look at the factors which are the same in both products. So as you can see we've got 2 in both products, so let's write the 2 down. What else have we got the same? We've got a 3 here and a 3 here, so let's put another 3 down. And what else have we got the same? We've got a 5 and we've got a 5 over here. So there's nothing else to pair up. So we just need to now multiply these common factors together. So 2 times 3 is 6 times 5 is 30. So our highest common factor of 90 and 150 is 30. Thanks for watching.